Hey everybody, it's James. How you doing today? Thanks for coming back to the channel. And for all you new people, I am an ex-Iowa farmer who grew up with uh, three channels on their one TV. And uh, we basically read books, played board games, and cards. That was more important than movies and TV and things like that, and I'm still doing that to this day, besides this channel that my boys basically talked me into starting. So I think it's going pretty good, but we got a lot of movies to watch. Today, I am super excited. We're getting back to one of my favorite movies that we've watched, and that is Back to the Future franchise. We watched Back to the Future 1 a few months ago, and so now we're getting to Back to the Future Part 2. I pulled up the poster, and they're not telling me nothing. It looks exactly the same as when they left in Back to the Future Part 1. The, you know, the DeLorean's flying. He's got his funky glasses on. Not a lot there. <laughs> Uh, Back to the Future 2 was filmed in 1989. It is a sci-fi comedy, both things I love, and stars Michael J. Fox and Christopher Lloyd and Thomas F. Wilson as Biff. Biff is a great character, um, at least the way he plays it. And from my understanding, the comments were he's not like that in real life at all. It's very tough for him to play this role. So I think that's great that he's reprising his role as Biff. Anyways, so yeah. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And thanks always to my Patreon members. They get access to these re uh, reactions a couple of days in advance. And then they get the full reactions, which is the best. Because I have to take these films and cut them down to about this much. So the full reactions is really where all the good stuff is. Thanks a lot, everybody. Enjoy. Oh man, you a psycho sore eyes. Is that the same girl? That's not the same girl. Oh, here comes Doc. What are we becoming assholes or something? Oh no 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 no. He had to think about it. <laughs> what the hell is going on here? Yeah. Oh, uh, is Biff gonna be a problem again? Hi, right, Doc. What's going on, huh? Where are we? When are we? At 4.29 p.m. on Wednesday, October 21st, 2015. You mean we're in the future? That was only seven, seven years ago. Wow. I'm going to be able to see my wedding dress. Wow. God, I wonder where we live. I bet it's yeah. a big... Maybe this wasn't the best idea to bring her. How many kids? Doc! What the hell are you doing? Relax, Marty. It's just a sleep-inducing alpha rhythm generator. This way, when she wakes up, she'll think it was all a dream. Very nice landing. You to the skies, Marty, but I was afraid you wouldn't recognize me. I went to a rejuvenation clinic and got a whole natural overhaul. Oh, really? What do you think? <laughs> he looks exactly the same. <laughs> he looks exactly the same. Ooh, yeah. Cool. On this cap. Perfect. You're the spinning image of your future son. Yeah, that's what I thought. His kid. In exactly two minutes, you go around the corner into the cafe 80s. What are these things on the wall? Then wait for a guy named Griff. Right. Griff's gonna ask you about tonight. Are you in or out? Whatever he says, whatever happens, say no. You're not interested. Okay. Look what happens to your son. Oh. Youth jailed. It's just like me. Was tried, convicted, and sentenced to 15 years in the state penitentiary within two hours? The justice system works swiftly in the future now that they've abolished all lawyers. Oh, they abolished all the lawyers. Your daughter attempts to break him out of jail and she gets sent up for 20 years. This one event starts a chain reaction that completely destroys her entire family. Yeah. I backtracked everything to this one event. That's why we're here today, to prevent this incident from ever happening. Man, Doc's been busy. Be careful around that Griff character. He's got a few short circuits in his bionic implants. Oh, bionic implants. I want to know about those. I'd like some extra storage, please. There's a pond in front of the place now. That looks quite nice, actually. Yeah, that's nice. They have a big tree and a nice little garden. 
That looks really nice now. It's interesting they abolished all the lawyers. That'd be difficult. There's a lot of lawyer stuff that are not criminal based. How do you make a will? Mike Jackson. Nice. Oh, look, it's Michael Jackson on the TV. Oh my gosh, he's the, like, server. You're Marty McFly's kid, aren't you? Biff? Oh. Biff's old. Hello? Hey. Hello, oh, geez. anybody Ow. home? Ow. Huh? Hey, Gramps! I told you two coats of wax on my car, not just one. Say hello to your grandma for me. And oh, he still got a thing for grandma. Oh, I remember that game. You mean you have to use your hands? That's like a baby's toy. What? <laughs> what are you supposed to use? Pepsi, perfect. Damn, Pepsi. Uh, he didn't stop him. But I told you to stay in here. Griff, guys. So, Griff is the new Biff. Throat. Oh! He's a complete limp. Yeah. <laughs> he is! Are you in or out? Um, because I think that I should discuss it with my father. Wrong answer, McFly! Oh. Oh. oh, well, they're together now. Wow! Since when did you become the physical type? Oh, God, he's weird. No. Yeah, what are you, deaf and stupid? I said no. What's wrong, McFly? Chicken? What's wrong with being chicken? Nobody calls me. Is that a bat? Chicken. Oh, Griff is even bigger than Biff. Oh, that didn't stop him. This is all like a redo of the 50s. Oh, here we go. They got the little skateboards again. Hoverboard. How's that work? Oh. That would be very weird. Oh, he's gonna grab on the back, yeah. Boy, this is just like a repeat of one. Something very familiar. Yeah, <laughs> I bet it is, Biff. Is it work on water? It looks like it's work, uh, no, it's not working. Oh, cool. I like how it makes little growly noises. <laughs> Better up! There's a cop right there! Just jump in the water! Yeah. <laughs> oh! Oh, crap. Uh, maybe the cop will do something about it now. Buttheads. <laughs> Buttheads. Oh, cops are there now. Drying mode. Oh, drying the coat! Your jacket is now dry. That's cool! Lightning struck that thing 60 years ago! They still haven't fixed it? What did you just say? I said I wish I could go back to the beginning of the season. Put some money on the Cubbies. Yeah. They, you, I wish I would have when they won the World Series too. Oh no. So he bought the the sports almanac. Fine, Gloria. Yeah, they're not very, being very incognito. The hell? Don't drive Trank, He's seeing both of them. Gang jailed. Therefore, your son won't go with him tonight, and that robbery will never take place. Thus, history, future history, has now been altered, and this is the proof. Oh. What's this? Uh oh. Uh, it's just. Mark! Yeah, I didn't no, that he doesn't the time want that. For financial gain. Uh oh. Hey, Scott! Cops. Hildell, age 47. 47? That's a hell of a good face, Larry. They used her thumbprint to assess her ID. Since her thumbprint never changes over the years, they simply assume she's the Jennifer of the future. Oh, of course. Continue and destroy the entire universe! <sighs> Granted, that's a worst-case scenario. Yeah. <laughs> I'd say that's worst-case scenario. <laughs> that's a... Why... See, like... Oh, he should have been parked there instead of parked in front of the building. I didn't invent the time machine to win at gambling. I invented the time machine to travel through time. I know, I know, Doc. Uh-oh. Biff heard all that. So, Doc Brown invented a time machine. Uh-oh, okay. I'm getting the plot line here. So how is Biff gonna tell his previous self? 
about the uh, time machine. Is he going to try and steal the time machine? Is that what he's going to try and do? And they get stuck here or something like that? You're tuned to the Scenery Channel. The Scenery Channel. Oh. <laughs> there you go, under the stairs. Mom? Mom, is that you? Oh, God. Oh, oh my God, is that Michael J. Fox? <laughs> Dressed as a girl? Your father tried to prove he wasn't chicken and he ended up in an automobile accident. Oh, you mean with the Rolls Royce? Mm -hmm. So that hasn't happened yet. Come on, Doc, I want to check on my ass. We can't risk you running into your older self. Yeah. Well, plus, they need to stay with the time machine. <clears throat> uh, trouble's afoot. Yeah. Biff Sr. I'd be careful, old timer. There's a rough neighbor in the seat. Right here, here it is. They're still doing paper receipts? I wish it would get rid of that. Everything should be digital at this point. The paper receipts, if you look at them a year later, they're blank anyways. The man in the Ooh, cool. Look at all the fresh veggies and a banana. Oh, there's a thing walking the dog. Yup. Yup. There goes Biff. Yeah, I was right. They're gonna get stuck there. Oh, it's so little. What are they? Hydrator? Hydrate level four, please. What? Oh, no way. Is it ready? That's awesome. I could get fired. It's illegal. I mean, he's got two ties. Unless you want everyone in the division to think you're chicken. Oh, man. See, having a trigger like that is horrible. Just tell him to go to hell. Here's my card. Scan it. I'm in. McFly! Oh. I was monitoring that scan you just interfaced. You are terminated! Read my no, facts! No! Please, no! Facts! He fired! I'm fired! Ah! Are they still fax things? Oh, you dummy. I'm old! I'm old, I'm young. <laughs> Oh, did Biff come back? Yeah, he did. He came back. Uh-oh, he broke his cane. Like, just imagine the danger if a time machine were to fall in the wrong hands. Yeah, like Biff. Better than I devote myself to studying the other great history of the universe. What? Women. Women? <laughs> Women? <laughs> when she wakens here at her own house and it's dark, you should be able to convince her that it was all a dream. There's bars on the window. I remember bars being on these windows. Yeah. Oh, yeah, no. Things have changed. Well, I think we're going to have to go back again and fix all this crap. Figure out what happened. <laughs> oh, crap. That's not his bedroom. Oh, crap. Get out of there. Oh, yeah, things have changed a lot. Eat lead slackers! Yeah, eat lead slackers! <laughs> what is going on? Biff Tannen's Pleasure Palace? So Biff has destroyed the entire town. Toxic waste reclamation plant. Right next to the... Right next to the casino. And how a trip to the racetrack on his 21st birthday made him a millionaire overnight. Wow, he was using the thing to make bets. And turned Hill Valley's dilapidated courthouse into a beautiful casino. Oh, he turned the courthouse into a casino? Third time's a charm. Third time's a charm. Oh, he married his mom? Easy way or the hard way. Oh. Oh, crap. Whacked him in the head. Back on the good old 27th floor. The 27th floor? Oh my god! You're supposed to be in Switzerland, you little son of a bitch! My father! I'll be back up here in an hour, so you better not be. Leave Dad. Marty, are you feeling alright? No! <laughs> no, no, not at all! Where's my father? Where's George McFly? Your father is in the same place he's been for the past 12 years. Yeah? Where? Oak Park Cemetery. Oh, he's dead. Okay. 
Oh. Yeah, there we go. There's his dad. You know what happened? Yes, Marty, I know. What happened? Murdered? It's an awful, 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 awful mess. He's trying to get to his, his bed. <laughs> Poor guy. That this line represents time. Yeah, I got it. Uh, he screwed the timeline up, and so there's an alternate one. I found them in the time machine. Along with this. Yeah. Okay, got it all pieced together. It's my foot. Yeah, it is. Yep. It's my fault if I hadn't bought that damn book. None of this would have ever happened. Well, that's all in the past. You mean the future. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> they have to go to the past. This has oh, happened. Oh, he got committed. We have to find out the exact date and the specific circumstances of how, where, and when young Biff got his hands on that sports almanac. I'll ask him. Okay, that's a good idea. Party's over, Biff. Gray's Sports Almanac. Oh, yeah, I bet that got his attention. Party's over. First you tell me how you got it. How, where, and when. November 12th, 1955, that was when. I just picked my car up from the shop because I'd rolled it in a drag race a few days earlier. I thought you crashed into a manure truck. <laughs> he knows everything. Father told me about it. This crazy old codger with a cane shows up. He says he's my distant relative. I don't see any resemblance. Yeah, right. It was him. <laughs> okay. So he lays he this book that. on me. No catch. Just keep it a secret. Oh, and he told me one more thing. That someday a crazy, wild-eyed scientist or a kid may show up asking about that book. Uh-huh. And if that ever happens... Two McFlies with the same gun. Oh, he jumped. Oh, he's got the flying machine. Yeah, he's got the thing. Oh, oh. yeah, there you go. Okay, so, back to the same year as the first Back to the Future. Back to where it all started. Yeah, behind the sign. Okay, I love this. <laughs> I love this. Sometime today, Old Biff will show up to give Young Biff the almanac. Once Old Biff is gone, grab the almanac any way that you can. Remember, both of our futures depend on this. You don't have to remind me of that, Doc. Get yourself some 50s clothes. Check, Doc. Something inconspicuous! <laughs> Doc, come in. Yeah. That's inconspicuous! He lives with his grandma? I'm going to get my car, Grandma! Yeah. Go get it! <laughs> He's such a dick. Well, you're very conspicuous. What are you why are you following so close? If I catch the guy that caused this, I'll break his neck! The manure. I remember that. So the old man's right there. Oh! Oh! Ow! What a cute skirt! I love her skirt with the giraffes on it. Calvin Klein, no, it's not okay. You're going with me, understand? I mean, when are you gonna get it through your thick skull, Lorraine? You're my girl. I wouldn't be your girl even if, even if you had a million dollars! Oh! Oh, good for her. I'm gonna marry you someday, Boy, he's Lorraine. obsessed. Someday you'll be my wife. Just get in the car, Tannen. Today's your lucky day. Okay. So this is... Oh my god, it took the bushes out. <laughs> this book tells the future. It tells the results of every major sports event till the end of the century. Very nice. Thank you very much. Now why don't you make like a tree and get out of here? It's a leave, you idiot. You sound like a damn fool. When <laughs> you could make a fortune with this book. Let me show you. Bet you a million bucks UCLA wins at 19 to 17. Field goal, UCLA wins 19 to 17. Yeah, that's how it works. I bet he's taking him seriously now. All right, I'll, I'll take a look at it. 
Never leave this book laying around. Don't you have a safe? You no, you don't have a safe. safe. Yeah, you know, yeah. <laughs> he knows he doesn't have a safe. Keep it on you, like this. Okay, so we got the whole story now, okay. It's a beautiful car. Oh, he, there's the DeLorean. Marty, you must be extremely careful not to run into your other self. My yep. other self? Yes! Oh, there's your other self right there. Be a pal, hand me a 5 8 inch wrench out of that toolbox. Don't you mean three quarters? Why, you're right. By the man says there's not going to be any rain. There's going to be plenty of rain, all right. Wind, thunder, lightning. Could be one hell of a storm. Well, thanks. Nice talking to you. Oh, gosh. Okay, so now we're at the dance. Man, they're bringing everything back around again. Love it. There's his dad. And it's funny, they're just using scenes from the previous movie. That's funny. That's a great way of editing this together. Oh, there they come with the car, okay. He finds out that she's been parking with boys and smoking. <laughs> well, 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 Mr. Tannen. And what have we here? Sports, statistics, interesting subject. Slacker! Did he take the book? So the principal has the book now? Oh, God. <laughs> That's the car, isn't it? Yeah. They want. Get past Anything that. Else. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Oh! 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 There we go. There we go. He got it. Yes. Uh-oh. No. Ooh la la. He took the book cover and put it over a different book. Oh. There he is. He's gonna punch him! Marty, the entire future depends on you finding Biff and- Well, he's right there behind you! Run away! Stop! Yeah, he's right there! Punch him, punch him, punch him, punch him! That's my old man's about to dick Biff! Punch him, punch him, punch him! Yeah! <laughs> Love it! That was a good punch, too. So he's knocked out. You can go grab the thing. Fine. Hey, did you just take his wallet? He just took that guy's wallet. Uh, I hope you don't, mind, but George... don't watch. Get on the roof. Hey, butthead. Are you chicken? Oh, with the chicken thing again. Nobody calls me chicken. Oh. Oh. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, his almanac. You my stuff. Oh. Oh. Now he lost the almanac again. Boy, he's just everything's getting screwed up. This is just he loses it, he gets it, he loses it, he gets it. Okay, go get him. Let's land on him. We'll cripple his car. Marty, he's in a 46 Ford. We're in a DeLorean. He ripped through us like we were tinfoil. Okay. <laughs> oh, the hoverboard. Let it go! Oh, where'd it go? It's on the roof. You got it. Uh, you're not going too fast. He's gonna run your ass over. What's that? Oh, whoa! Oh no! Oh, he got full of shit again. <laughs> he got full of poop again. He got full of poop again. Bernard! Oh, God, why is he always getting his mouth out of his mouth? In my hand, dog! He got it in my hand! Burn it! Burn it? Okay, well, how's he gonna burn it? How's he... Oh! Oh, that's right, he took the matches off Biff's desk. There we go. Auto detailing! Yay! Honored instead of murdered. Yeah. Okay. Everything's fixed. Uh, he's commended. It's the ripple effect. The future is back. Now let's go home. 
Yeah, let's go home. Oh, jeez. Holy crap. Be careful! You don't want to get struck by lightning! No, where'd he go? Now he's stuck there! Crap. So did he go to the future? Where'd he go? Did he go to the past? His little thingy was like all screwing up. Is your name Marty McFly? Yep. A letter. A letter? Who the hell are you? Western Union. So we've had that envelope in our possession for the past 70 years. 70 years? Did you say 70 years? Yeah, 70 years, two months, uh, 12 days to be exact. Here, sign on line six, please. So what is he supposed to do now? It's from the dock! You'll receive this letter immediately after you... Well, why are you getting it wet? I've been living happily these past eight months in the year 1885. 1885! 1885! The dock's alive! He's in the old west, but he's alive! There's only one man who can help me! Oh, he's going to the dock in 1955! Everything, I love this. Everything is just a big circle. Here comes the lightning. Yup, yup, yup. Boom! And he's off. Okay. Everything's great. Except now, Marty's stuck in 1955. Ah! This is all about time. All about time. Oh, here he comes. Here comes the, like... From the future, the thing... Yeah, he's probably like, what the hell? Just sent you back to the future. Yeah. Oh, I know you did send me back to the future, but I'm back. I'm back from the future. Great Scott. A lot of people commented that I'm supposed to stop right away as soon as I see the to be continued because there's a whole bunch of spoilers. So that's what I'm going to do. Okay, so that was Back to the Future 2. And uh, it's great. I mean, I love all the circles that are constantly happening. Like, and he got to see himself. He got to see his dad punch out Biff, which was awesome. And now we're going to the Old West. The Old West. <laughs> which is actually one of my favorite time periods, the Old West. Uh, medieval is my absolute favorite, but uh, Old West is great. I do love the chivalry of it. And, um, that, I mean, it was great. The future was weird. <laughs> so this came out in the, God, I can't remember when this came out. I'd have to look it up again. But they were saying it was 2015. We're already past 2015. We don't have any of the cool crap that was in the future. We don't have hoverboards. We don't have flying cars. Uh, let's see. The big flat TVs, we kind of have that. I mean, it was a curtain, but not the same. The doors you can open with your thumb, that's a thing. No, it's not like broad spectrum. A lot of people don't have it, but it's a thing. What else? The fax, hilarious that faxes still exist. Faxes, they do exist. They're just not, I mean, people email, they don't fax things. Um, but you'd be surprised in my lifetime, um, even modern like in the last 10 years, I've had to fax multiple things. And you have to like go to a Kinko's to fax something or something like that. Because <laughs> I don't have a fax machine. <laughs> Anyways, the everybody was great. Um, Okay, so weird thing, weirdness. Michael J. Fox, I'm pretty sure, played his daughter, which was weird. <laughs> he did not look good as a girl. And what else? Um, the Okay, tell me. I think the girlfriend was a different girlfriend. I'm pretty sure. Because I don't remember her looking like that. You'll have to correct me. Comment below if that was the same. I'm, I don't think it was the same girl. I'm pretty sure Michael J. Fox was his daughter. Was his own daughter. But I'm not positive. What else? I, I mean, I'm going to have to get to Back to the Future 3, obviously. We'll see how the Old West is with Doc. And more importantly, how he gets to the Old West. Like how he doesn't have a car. How does he get to the Old West? Because it, it appears Doc is stuck there. It's, he's been there for 70 years. Right? 
77 years or 70? I don't know. Anyways, I guess we're just going to have to wait and see. Thank you again to my Patreon members. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much. And, um, yeah, there's lots of great movies ahead. Uh, the Patreons and I talked, and we have, like, four big movies coming out over the next month or so. And um, they're the first ones that get to choose what movies I get to see. Um, if you want to think about doing Patreon, I'd appreciate it. Um, we're trying to save enough money to for me to build a new gaming... Uh, not a gaming PC, God. A PC capable of doing this type of editing. Um, but a gaming PC would do this type of editing, so it's still correct, kind of. Anyways, thank you very much, everybody. And don't forget that you, right there, you are awesome. Thanks, everybody. Have a great one. Bye.